HP EliteBook 840 G3 SSD Replacement. Hello everyone, welcome to the repair division. Today we're replacing the SSD on this HP EliteBook. We already did diagnostics on the SSD using Western Digital Data Lifeguard and it failed. Now, let's start the repair. Make sure you're properly grounded. Then let's proceed to remove all the 10 screw covers located at the bottom case. You can remove those with the black stick or with the tweezer. Alright, after the screw covers are removed, there are 10 Phillips screws that will need to be removed as well. This is to be able to pry out the bottom plastic case and get to the internal components. Once the screws have been removed, we can proceed to pry out with the black stick flat end the bottom case. Kind of making space between the bottom case and the top case. Once the bottom case is removed, we see all internal components. Here we have the battery, RAM, SSD, CPU fan, CPU, Wi-Fi card, and a second hard drive bay. Let's disconnect the battery. It has two Phillips screws. We remove them and pull the battery up. Once the battery is removed, we're going to proceed to remove the SSD. Replacement part ready to be installed. Then we make sure the SSD is seated properly. Let's proceed to install that. We install the battery, the screws, and the screw covers. Then the next step is to install Windows or any operating system of your choice. This is the end of our video. If you liked the video, consider subscribing to the channel. And if you have any questions, don't forget to leave them in the comment section. Thank you all for watching.